Yo, what up guys, it's Hero here, and today I got you guys another deck video. This deck is brought to you by Dialect, which is a cult main that I personally haven't seen play in a while, but he's also a really good player and I've known him since the game is basically released. Anyways, I don't think he streams, if he does, you can let me know down in the comment section. Also, guys, if your deck is ever used within the video and you want to elaborate on your deck, give a long TLDR if you want to in the comment section. For me personally, I don't like TLDRs, it doesn't really do much for me. For me, it's a little bit better just to learn it myself because, you know, I don't want to end up playing the exact way you do. It's just more fun that way. Anyways, let's go ahead and jump into the deck. As usual, we'll be reading the attack sequences and then jumping into the alternative attacks. At the end of the reading, we'll be going ahead and talking about how I feel about the deck just at a glance. So let's go ahead and start off with top right stance. Top right stance starts off with roll back fist, finished off with under knee kick. The last slot is not used. The alternative attack for top right stance is side kick. Next up is the top left stance. Top left starts off with jump light kick, followed up with crouching elbow, finished off with donkey slap. The alternative attack for top left stance is foot slap, which is actually one of my favorite moves if you didn't know. Next up is bottom left stance. Bottom left stance starts off with back fall strike, followed up with pushed back kick, finished off with drunken smash. The alternative attack for bottom left stance is stretch out hook. Last but not least, we have bottom right stance, which starts off with back trip kick, finished off with low kick. The third slot is not used. And the alternative attack for bottom right stance is scissor kick. So basically, I like the way this deck is set up somewhat, but there's some moves that I would personally change. But let's go and start off with the alternative attacks. I like how it's set up as a four attack attack sequence. For example, we have bottom right going into bottom left, which goes into top right, which goes into top left. So that's scissor kick, stretch out hook, side kick, foot slap, reset, back into scissor kick, and just continuate that, etc. if you want to. Don't forget though, since this is technically a whole different attack sequence, but it's all about pressing Y, you can basically use your regular attack sequences into a whole another mix up. So you can always keep somebody guessing the whole entire time if you learn this deck in and out. I don't think I'll be able to do it to its full potential based off of it's a showcase. So I haven't really played with a deck like talking about it, um, but I feel like this goes really well with what he has in his attack sequences. On top of that though, the only thing I would change in the attack, um, alternative attack side is top right stance. I would change that to body blow because it avoids thrust and vertical attacks and being able to do that at any time, at any moment is a really great thing to have. Though we do have rollback fist and top right stance, just body blow just saves lives. There's just no reason not to have it. It's just so good. Um, that's the only thing I would probably replace, though we'll be lacking in damage from that point. And sidekick is a good mix up to have as well. So I don't know, you can kind of change momentum with that faint into a sidekick, faint again into a sidekick, depending on how gullible um, your opponent is. So. I don't know it's kind of like a preference right there i prefer body blow here but sidekick can work so i'm not upset about that overall the alternative attacks are fine um the only thing i don't like about the attack sequences is bottom right stance if somebody has jump light kick in their alternative side or for example we have it in our top left stance if somebody has jump light kick as a starter they're going to completely knock us out of bottom right stance easily like we can hit him with back trip kick and that's bam jump light kick i'm knocked out of it they can even do it before i even get in the back trip kick so you know it, it's just one of those things if they have jump light as a starter or as an alternative we can get knocked out of bottom right stance consistently so we're gonna have to do a lot of mix-ups with bottom right stance i believe but it only depends on if they have jump light kick um the bottom left stance we have backfall strike into pushback kick into drunken smash Anytime I've personally used backfall strike into pushback kick, that gets a windfall, it gets parried, it gets fucking culted with backfall strike, and then they kind of like dodge out of the way or they got body blow. For example, that's another reason why we should have body blow. But anyways, yeah, anytime I use these two moves right here together, it never goes well for me. So hopefully it goes well in this video, but yeah, it works for other people, so more power to you, but I have bad luck with this sequence. Um, Drunken Smash though, if that hits, yeah damn. So overall, do I like the deck in terms of the way it looks? Yeah. Only recommendation or the alternative move that I would suggest is top right stance, uh, alternative attack being body blow. That's the only recommendation I would have. But overall, the deck itself, I think looks solid. The only way to find out is by going into a showcase. So without further ado, let's go into a showcase. Okay, and we're finally playing with Dialect's deck. 
hopefully things go well. Um, I don't know. I don't know anyone by the name of South Paul, so this could be interesting. I also haven't played Cold in a while, so this will really be interesting. Alright, you're playing stagger style, so that means you're going to either be a guy who forward staggers a little way too much, or you'll be a guy to back stagger a little too much. We'll try to absorb that forward stagger though. Yeah, I was kind of waiting for that. I'm not even going to lie to you. Come on, man. Let's do it. That back dodge. <laughs> if, he knew who, if he knew his range, he would have been able to just forward stagger me. See, now we're forward staggering. I approve. All right. So he's a guy that mainly just side staggers shit. There's nothing wrong with that, though. Shit, I don't side stagger enough. <laughs> but then again, some people overdo it. Where are you going? No, I'm not gonna let you heal. What the heck? What do you think this is? A medical service that's free? No, no, no. You better earn that heal. Fuck no. Dude, whenever rollback roll fist misses and then like goes right back into itself i lose my shit like i fucking love that okay that may lua that hurt don't do that again i didn't even know you had me lua you've yet to do it <laughs> that was a little early yeah he side staggers a little too much Nice try though, nice try. To Gory Krovak. Krovak sounds like a Russian name that I've heard in another game. No comment. Anyways, this deck so far has uh, done us a little bit of wonders, but that guy really wasn't much of a challenge, so... I don't know, we'll just have to see how this guy plays. <laughs> Jump light kick to save the day. Oh, man. Okay, so this deck. I don't really have anything to say about it. It's like a pretty solid deck, to be honest. Doesn't really have all that many gimmicks. It's just learn the deck and you'll be fine. <laughs> or just know what the moves are for the deck and you'll be fine. get earthquake one more time i swear all right man last round what you got man i actually tried to cult that you can cult earthquake right because i feel like i should have had that or maybe i had to do it a little bit more early
if you even thought that was gonna hit, I feel bad for you. There was nothing I was gonna be able to do to that. So I literally just had to outfaint you. Fuck. <laughs> I clicked record so late, and I'm so sorry you don't get a nice little intro thing. But um, yeah. Did you just thumbs up me, boy? What? What the fuck do you thumbs up me for? Disrespectful. You're playing stagger style? Okay. I hope you're not one of those boys who forward stagger like five minutes per second. That made no sense. Oh, that was lag. Hello? You gonna do anything except for block? What the fuck? And now he's giving up. See, man, this is why I don't like playing this game sometimes. Because people are just like, you know, it's hard to deal with it. So I'm just gonna sit here and just, which is not gonna fight. Fuck it, we'll just move on to the next fight. I know you guys aren't gonna want to watch the rest of this. Sierra, 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 how do you? All right, let's do it. Ugh. Are you gonna come up here or am I going down there? Looks like I'm going down here. Do you know about the map that we run over here? Oh, oh, okay. All right, you didn't try to hit me. Respect. You gonna come over here or are you gonna make me come to you? We're really doing that right now? Hello? Hello, like, there's so much space over here. All right, fuck it. It's weird that he went for the exact same move twice. Damn, that fucking move hit so hard. Oh man, did you hear that sound? Man, I broke like three ribs and a wrist, dude. It's crazy. Some good job, me. Rav the series, let's do this, man. You put yourself in the corner. I don't know why you keep doing stuff like that, but it's not my fault. So something I've actually started doing, um, and I'm glad I tried it with this deck specifically. Um, if you use exhaust, it's like a free cult that has more of a window. Um, at least it feels like it has a bigger window than cult does. So if you're ever a person that's using cult and you want an extra, you know, cult that actually does a hardcore effect to the player, that would definitely be the way to go. All right, me talking got my shit wrecked. Oh. Ah, I shouldn't have tried to attack. Come on, dude. Like, hurry up. What are you doing? Oh my god, fuck it. Oh wait, no, wait, what? No, god damn it, no, I said no. <laughs> oh, good fight. I think this deck is pretty straightforward. I don't think we really need to showcase it all that much more. Again, the only thing I'd really change in this deck is top right stance and maybe a little bit in bottom right, but overall it's a pretty solid deck. So any person who wants to try this out and you're a decent cult player, I think you'll have a good time with this. Anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, you can give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next video. Later.